music can change the feeling of any performance. It really does bring it to life. When everybody saw Garden State, the thing that really popped out was the music. Zach's got a very specific taste in music and how it complements his stories. I think my first real experience with art was musicals, and I think it ingrained in me a sense of the importance of a well-placed song. This is it! It's no secret I really love the Shins. I love their music. And so I said to them, would you consider watching the movie and then writing the song that comes out of you? And that's when they came up with, so now what? Coldplay if they would consider watching the movie and then writing a song that came out of them. And then Chris Martin had the idea of having Cat Power sing it, and that became the title track of the, of the whole movie. You can pick anyone you want. I wish I was here. Just as long as it's unique and amazing like you. Paul Simon has just been so good to me. I've been trying to cut a, a video or a trailer or something to Obvious Child since I was in film school. I mean, it's like an editor's dream, that song. It's just, just such a driving, great African drum beat. Welcome to Aston Martin. It's really about what it sounds like when you floor it from a full stop. There will be no flooring it from a full stop. No, sir. Thank you. People who know how to use music well, it really does become a part of the fabric of what they are as a director. For Zach, his love of music and his love of film is an opportunity for him to have that symbiotic relationship. Action! If you're a music aficionado, you'll know some of this music. The Shins, Bon Iver, Coldplay, we've curated it into one beautiful package. It's such an honor. Woo!